What are you all doing? Not really. Matt, did you install install see if they use yet? Did increase the price? What they increase it to? 
All right, now they increase the price. It's up to 10 quid. Dang. Get back to working on my crafter. Did I tell you I got my botanist to uh, four uh, eighty? I mean, nice. Yeah, I did my relic. Ooh. And I thought it was the best axe, and then I realized there's a crafted axe that's 490. But I think the relic one will be able to be upgraded next patch, so. Now, the front, the new um, relic thing's supposed to come out this patch, right? Halfway? Mm hmm. There's un unspoiled trees over here. I guess I better go get those. I'm sure they're worth something since it's in Shadowbringers. Thank you. 
They sell at their minimum price. That's kind of pitiful. Evans work stuff still sells for a lot of money. That axe looks weird. I don't want it.
there's a bot buying steel pick pickaxes. Because I just put four steel pickaxes on the market board, and they, as soon as the person hit the the market, all four of them sold immediately. Observer Remaster. It's gonna be, oh, Redux is going to be a launch title. What is? Observer. I don't know what that is. It's a walking sim kind of thing. I still have the original Observer. Some Observer System Redux, which is just uh, upscaled. It's not even that old to get Oops. enhanced already, but it added puzzles, new some additional side quests, 4K textures, ray tracing, and all that kind of stuff. It's a really, it's really good. It's pretty good. I like the walking sim called. Uh... Death Stranding. <laughs> it's really good. Observer is like you're this detective. And he's the observer. Observers in this world are like interrogators. But like the last line of interrogators where if you're still not giving information after being interrogated or tortured, they call an observer in to jack into your mind to get the information forcefully. What was that game I watched you play with a chick? Which chick? That you had to get into the mines and stuff. Remember me? Yeah, that was it. Where it was like a little action thing where you can and you can change the memories of Yeah, people. change the memories so they can remember something different to get you by through things or so you can um, try and convince them. Yeah. I remember watching you play that. And then there's a fight mechanic where you overload their minds with memories and you're just like, ah! How do you overload their minds again? <laughs> they turn into crows. <laughs> if I worked at a library, I would keep putting How to Kill a Mockingbird in the instructional section. Book keeps That's getting out here. Book. Huh? That's an instructional book. It's on such and such aisle. Yeah. It's like it's an instructional book. It says how to. Yeah, that, it's how to not, kill a it. That's why I put it in there. It's not. It doesn't go in uh, classic literature. No, it goes in instructional. There's this person, he worked at a library, and he went to, um, he got one of the books that were very rarely checked out, if not, like, ever, and he put, like, $20 in there, and a note for, the, for that one person that checked out that book. So 
saying like, congratulations for checking out this book. Here's twenty dollars. Being the first person in like thirty years to check out this book. I'd like the mermaid joke book, please. <laughs> you know what streamers I miss the most? The original streamers. Party streamers? Um, freelance astronauts. Back when there was no Twitch or like. YouTube streaming, it was all you stream. That was great. Oh, that. Because it. So, it, what, it, what, um, what it was is it was just a group of friends from uh, something awful, something awful forum slash website. Um, some other people are, are from there as well. Um, and they will all go to to Maxwell Adams' house. They will always go to their house on like every Friday or something. And so there was about there was four of them, and they were just there having snacks or getting drunk, and they were just playing games. There was it was no like there was no like chat or anything. They were streaming, but there was like not really that many people talking to them. Just having a blast. It was pretty great. I remember there was a Christmas one where um, New Super Mario Brothers Wii first came out. They got for Christmas. And they were playing, playing on Christmas Day. Just drunk. It was, it was pretty fun. Well, I don't think they were all drunk. Because some one of them was complaining about how there was no alcohol. No, not enough alcohol. There was, there was a part where, um, I don't know if I can find that clip. It was pretty funny. It was, it was World 8 and it was like a little seesaw thing that one person can control. And the, and the person got on and was just singing, um... Pull the man down while he was frying it and just purposely running and running his friends into things. Oh my gosh. There was one where he was get, he was- they were playing Lemmings, like, um, versus Lemmings. He was getting upset, so he just started singing, um, There's a Hole in the Bucket. It came more angry as he was doing it, and it was getting more violent trying to sabotage the other person. Fair Epic Pipes Maxwell Adams. Occasionally with diabetes. Ar they archived all their stuff on their YouTube channels.
You know what's interesting about the relic weapon? I think I already told you that it's all based in Heaven's Ward. Or the, the not relic weapon, the relic uh, crafting tools. Wait, what? All the relic crafting tools are, yeah. like, the things you have to do are in Heaven's Ward. Yeah. Yeah. I might be excited because everybody thinks that that area that you're in right now is going to be the housing area in the firmament, and it's not. It's not. That's not where the housing is going to be. It may be attached to it, but I, I don't even think it will be attached to it. I wonder if they're going to do something to piss people off, like destroy it again, like immediately. <laughs> and you just have to keep building it. And repairing it. It'd be kind of cool. thing that's coming out the battlement or the what's it called whatever the new thing's gonna be i think that that's gonna take place from the robinostra side of things and they're gonna find that they can't attack the empire from that way so they're gonna have to go through the ish guard
Really like to use your guild up. They're like, hey, go to Idleshire to do your next uh, gathering quest. Oh, it's gonna make you go back to Gridania. <laughs> oh well, it's it's only like 600 gil. You should have seen those two. Oh, Rod, uh, they were cute. They, they're both married, they're on their thing, but they're both like the same blue, and they're both wearing like the Aura uh, outfits from that particular tribe. <laughs> it was really cool. <laughs> and even their chocobo was dressed in similar attire. <laughs> it was really cool. Then they got on their wedding chocobo, but I just thought that was super.
<laughs> Idol style. Go to Gridania. Go to Limpsa. Now go to Kagane. All right. Just this botanist quest, like. I don't remember the the Fisher one all like took place. You would go to Lampsa and then you would go right back to Kagane. All of these are like go to Idleshire, go to Gridania, go to this. Oh, it's like this person wants you to talk to this person uh, who is the leader of the botanist guild, and then you talk to them and they're like, well, maybe this person over in Lampsa will know. <laughs> Oh wait, they don't know. Well, maybe if you go to Kugane, somebody there will know. Full of people right now. Holy crap.
This guy has a a pet watermelon. I think that was, Have you seen that? I think that was from the um the summer thing that passed. The recent one? I believe so, because it was all like watermelon based. Never didn't see it. Oh no, I'm sorry. It's from. Oh no, no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a. It's gardening. Allegan melon seeds. You grow it. Oh, mate. You can get them just from the suppliers in the housing areas. The seats. I just made 200k. Nice. This will pay back for all the dang clothes I bought from my Makote. <laughs> Triple try triad card. I got the he in card, that's what matters. <laughs> that card though. Do you have, oh my do you have God. music though? Um so I found a way we could get the music. It's just like you, me, and Tabby queue up. <laughs> For uh Wait, I have all these cards. Interesting. I must not have used one. Um, but for Mahjong, Tabby and I one night we played and we both got into the same Mahjong <laughs> match. But at first I was like, okay, we're just gonna play you know or we'll go and i with one hand at this the start i took everybody's points i think down to a thousand 
And I was just like, okay, well, let's just go ahead and end this. <laughs> What's that, love? Yeah, she was ready to go to bed anyways. But I felt really bad, because, I mean, I obliterated them. And then I had something happen that I don't... It was like, call the four valley... The four winds of the valley, or something like that. And it declares no winner. And you do it right at the start. And I've never seen that before. I've seen that a few times. I even had a yeah. hand of that. And I was just like, what does that even mean? I guess I'll do it. <laughs> You don't even get anything for it. Shit, I teleported to the wrong place. No, I didn't. I really like Stormblood. I know people, a lot of people's favorites, Heaven's Ward, but I think I like Stormblood better than Heaven's Ward. But I like Shadowbringers better than I like Stormblood, so. I like them in their order. I wonder where this guy's gonna tell me to go. Hey, you wanna find this mutant potato? You gotta go here. <laughs> okay, thanks. To the east, Othard. Okay, now that I'm level 65, I can take anything to the highest quality I want. Thank God. Because my perception's high enough. What's that skill do? Uncover gathering nodes can only be executed on... We'll literally need one more potato. Actually, that's where a lot of my money went to, is buying my gathering gear. Stuff's expensive. Blame that for that. Are you even playing anything, Matt? Raymond Legends. That's a great game. Tabby and I played. We, we beat everything, right? well, other than the Origins part. Yeah, where you unlock the original game. Or, I think it's the original game. The music levels are my favorite. Thank you. Excuse me. Yeah. Oh my god, it's Swanee. The Afro man.
So was it confirmed? I, I can't remember. It is Yoshida working on Final Fantasy 16 as the main director? Yep. Okay. Good for him. I wonder who's taking over for. Well, I guess the lead writer of Shadowbringers is gonna take over while he's working on that. He's doing both. I'll kill him. <laughs> No! He has he has confirmed he's that he is doing both and he's still doing both. He shouldn't be. In case you didn't know, he he's also does things with manga as well. Not not Final Fantasy related manga, but just a manga in general. He also still plays Dark Age of Camelot. In his free time, you know, that he has. You know, when he's not directing Final Fantasy 16 and Final Fantasy 14 and manga or packs of cigarettes. <laughs> there you go. I'll, I wouldn't be surprised if they didn't appoint him the dang head of Square Enix when he gets, you know, further al along. Oh, no, I think probably just give him the Final Fantasy um, in person. I forgot who's part of it. All right, let's go back to fucking Gridania. God, I'm interested in this story, but literally, we go talk to this person for her to be like, "I would go here." Use your link pearls. Come on, something. Yeah, they. I well, I still as a company move. Like since he knows, kind of, he definitely knows what he's doing, I think the company would appoint him over Square Enix, not just Final Fantasy. You mean Final May Cry? 16? I haven't watched the trailer, so I have no Oh, you have it? Oh, just let nope. you know... Uh, I, the... I refuse to watch it. You refuse to watch it? I refuse to watch the trailer. <laughs> Why? I will watch the official trailer <laughs> when it comes out. But um, I'm not watching this one. The De Devil May Cry lead person is also doing it as well. I can kind of see that. So, was Final Fantasy XV considered a flop or good? I think it was considered as good. I don't think it was considered as a flop. Okay. I've heard people, like, complain about it, and I'm I think, like... I think it's more, like, convoluted, because how, like, the full story is, like, spread through all over the place. Like, here's well, a movie, yeah, that, here's an anime, yeah. here's a story, here's DLCs that happen in between these certain parts, here's, like, something else that happened that goes over there, and you're, like, missing chunks of the story, and they're all so, spread all over the place or something. Yeah, well, see, you could play the base game, and but here's, it, it did the 13 mistake. It had all the information spread out in the, the main game, like, you could understand the story, but you had to read every single book in the game and like put the pieces together and be like, oh, this is who they represent. Oh, this is who this is them. And oh, you know, this guy's not really a bad guy. <laughs> so you haven't played it yet, have you? No. Okay. You should. It's really good. You know why they all dress goth and stuff? Hmm. 
Um, so originally, when the game was being developed, uh, Insomnia, the, the city uh, that Noctis and everybody's from, it, they worship death. Like, that was their main thing, is they worship death. So everybody there dressed goth, and there was also skeletons over everything, and it was um, very dark. Like, it was supposed to be extremely dark, um, but that was kind of their deity was just straight up death. Uh, but, of course, you know, that doesn't really translate into a, a Western Well, it was audience. supposed to be thir Versus 13. I thought it was, like, Etro or something. Since it was, like, that was technically still there, but they, like, removed all of it or something. No, it's all, all that went away. Uh, but this was, like, this was between release and that phase like it shifted to that again because of western audience or east are we eastern or west i always get We're western western yes thank you I, my brain suddenly just had a oh my god go to go to gridonia go back or sorry go to idleshire go back to gridonia go back to idleshire really enjoyed 15, but I also read everything in that game. I want my damn Noctis clothes for my fucking Makote now. But they're not on the store. Investigate the plot once again. Okay. Thank you. 